okay friends welcome you all for my today's session today also we are going to see one more interesting animation it's about flame animation okay so i already drawn the all the objects in different layers see the light flame candle everything i have given different layers okay and even the flame i have given gradient color because dark to light i need even candle also i applied that gradient color see i'm just uh, doing zoom in for you guys you can have a close look you got it okay i extended this frame initially up to 30 frames i am going to animate only this flame now okay so rest of the layers i am going to lock this flame is not a graphic okay i just drawn the shape so i am going to animate through shape animation okay i am not going to give graphic and uh, motion wheel i am not going to give the motion wheel I'm going to do this animation with the shape animation style. Okay, let's see. So this is my first frame, right? I'm going to modify a little bit first frame because I'm going to do the cycle of this flame from left to right side. So I will do small changes in this flame. Okay, so. this side i'll make little extra curve and this side i'll little uh, reduce okay the first frame is ready now i'm going to 10th frame see insert key frame insert key frame i'm going to move the object to opposite side see opposite side and i'm moving little bit here If you want to see the action, you can easily open Onion Skin and have a look. Have a look. Okay. See the first frame is here. My second frame is here. So this is fine. So how much uh, distance you want? You can move it. Later on, we can adjust the curves. Not a problem. And still, I'm going to do small. modifications okay yeah the curves this see my first frame is this second frame is this simple i'm going to connect with the shaped wheel see create shaped wheel see create shaped wheel still i can do small changes over here i think up to here the first frame also do it like this yes okay what happened i need a cycle so i'm copying this first frame press alt and paste it in 20th frame and again you connect with the shape we see this side one time again it will go back to the first frame right so rest of the frames you can easily remove select all the unused frames remove frames now just control enter or just check okay i feel this speed is little fast so i'm going to reduce the speed now so what i will do i will increase the timing so i will keep it up to 50th frame so that means see here the second half again i am going to increase up to 30 frame and this animation is 24 frame rate i will modify to 12 okay now we can check control enter see Let's zoom in right the flame animation is ready so you can make 24 frames no problem yeah see how simple it is the flame we are 
animating now still you can do small changes in the uh, middle because we need some exact curve so for that purpose i'm going to make little extra curve we have pull it little down okay so now see control enter you can see the action over here zoom in the flame is animating now we can adjust timing i'm going to reduce the two more frames remove frames remove frames and see the first and last frame it's the same right so i don't want this last frame so before one frame insert key frame and remove the a last frame then you will get a exact cycle clear key frame clear key frame control enter our candle light is now ready so if you want to do any further modification you can do remove frame i'm going to pull down this flame little bit down okay okay yes candle flame light is now right so still we can add some background lighting the colors so i will show you how to add that uh, background uh, gradient colors based on this lighting in my next video okay i hope you enjoyed this simple video it's a simple animation so i finish this demo or tutorial within Two to three minutes, so you can watch this and try to do your own candle animation like this. Okay, thanks for watching. Please subscribe my channel and uh, spread this channel a bit between uh, artistic-minded people or uh, creative people or uh, animators. So the beginners they can also learn from this uh, channel. Okay, thank you, thank you so much. Bye bye.